coming off of this match, the next time you're on TV, you put Vader over in just about 90 seconds when he returns to Kuwait after having his little mix up with the TV host over there. Yep. Vader has always had a reputation for being stiff and, and maybe even injuring some guys. What were your experiences with the now Hall of Famer? Yeah, same, same, same as everybody else's. <laughs> but uh, but the truth of it is, um, once you so so I was worse. Look, it takes a good man to beat me, but it don't take him long. Um, Vader beat me in ninety seconds. So I worked with Vader on the on a couple of loops, and finally I called my brother Steve, who had worked with him in Japan, and I said, "Man, he's beating my brains out." You know what I mean? Like every night I just get beat up for six minutes. You know, um, and he said, "Well, you got to get his respect." And I said, "Well." how do you do that? Carry his bag? What do you want me to do? You know? And he said, you got to punch him in the head as hard as you can. <laughs> I said, wait, what big van Vader? You want me to punch him in the head as hard as I can? And, and he said, yeah, he said, I promise you, you get his respect physically and you'll have, it'll be easy, smooth sailing. And truth be told, I'll never forget it. As long as I live, uh, he got me back in the corner and, you know, he would hit you with those, those fists, bam, bam, bam. Well, he hit me with like four or five of them that were good, good, snug shots, you know. I ducked out from under one, and I just peppered him in the forehead with uh, with not my closed fist, but my kind of like my fist. And I hit him about six times really, really hard in the head. And then I backed all the way to the opposite turnbuckle and put my hands up and just looked at him. And I, and I was just saying, hey, man, we don't. Uh, you know, I'm sorry, but I'm, if, if I'm getting my butt beat, I may as well get some punches in. So I, my brother was not lying. It was smooth sailing from then on every match, even later in that match, uh, it was better. But every match after that was, Hey man, what do you want to do? And he would be, yeah, he, he, he was a good guy. He really was. You just kind of had to get to know him. Uh, cause he was a baby bull for sure. He didn't do you, realize do you think your size helped with that situation and that you could actually stand up to him and start fighting back. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I'm look, if it would have been, and no offense, Ryan, but if it would have been you doing that, he may have no sold and came across right <laughs> then and gotcha and oh, boom, yeah. bang, bang, boom, you know, but, but yeah, maybe, and maybe he knows my brothers and you know what I mean? Like there's a, a lot of, a, th a lot of, a lot of reasons he didn't kill me at that point, <laughs> but my brother was right. Get his respect and you'll have it forever and I, and I did god rest his soul he was absolutely baby bull man he was a he was a big old big old man in the ring too Whew. do you think it always works that way of getting the respect and and, and giving those shots to say hey i ain't going to take this does it always work that way <laughs> well it's, so yes it always works that way but just be prepared because the guy might fire right back at you you know what i mean like i'm i was hitting him safely i didn't hit him in the face or in the nose or in the eye socket or mouth i was hitting him clubbing him on the hardest part of his head uh i was just clubbing him really hard and so i, I do think nine times out of ten it works Let how it's give supposed you one to of the ten that is just a funny <laughs> a funny memory that comes up that i remember please Alexa Bliss and Sasha Banks are in a, in, a, in a bunch of matches. And I think some of these are taking place at an access at WrestleMania and Sasha's laying in on Alexa and they have a, they, they've, this has been happening a lot. So someone says to Alexa, you got to lay it in and give it back to her and show her <laughs> yeah. what's up. And Alexa just turns to us and she's just like, I tried that. She hit me even harder. <laughs> well, that's the, that's it. Look, you, you, you but you're going to you're going to get beat up anyway yeah. if if somebody just does that like Bradshaw Bradshaw didn't beat you up in the face or beat you up in the throat or anywhere he beat you up in safe places but it was it hurt he beat you up and 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 at that time in our career me and Billy kind of welcomed that and yeah. and and gave it as good as we got it um but when when you do to go to get that respect, just know it's a double edged sword. They could come out respecting you. They could come out thinking, "Oh, we're fighting now," and uh, you know, yep. K Katie bar the door. Who's this Katie? And how do you bar a door? Like what? The, just lock the friggin' thing, right? <laughs> Katie's Katie's complicated as hell. <laughs> 